Hello everyone, Greg Wilkins here on Tuesday, January 12th, 2021 for today's edition of the Song of the Day devotional. Today's devotional is entitled, Celebrate, It's a New Day. And this devotional goes out to my first grade teacher, Mrs. Gail Davis, and I am so honored to be in her class and so is everyone that was in my class that was with us. And I remember succinctly in first grade, we would usually start off our day with a devotional song. And the one of my favorites, the one I remember the most, actually, is comes from Psalms 118, verse 24. And it's, this is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. And we would sing that song before we would start off to get ourselves motivated and excited about a brand new day. And no matter what yesterday was about, no matter if we got in trouble, no matter if we got chips pulled from our envelopes, no matter if we had to stay in for recess the day before, today is a new day. And we're going to start today refreshed and renewed and energized about what we're going to do the next day. And today, being Tuesday being Classical Tuesdays, I found a fitting piece that reminds us that, hey, it's a new day, so let's get excited about the new day. This piece is called A Festival Prelude. It's written by Alfred Reed, and it was commissioned for the Tri-State Music Festival back in 1962. It was commemor commemorated for their 25th anniversary, and it was commissioned to, for, and by <laughs> the Phillips University Concert Band. Phillips University is in Eden, Oklahoma, Enid, I'm sorry, Oklahoma, and it's no longer here, but it was the first, the first band to play this piece. And it's considered one of Alfred Reed's best pieces for wind literature. And it's, it's a, it's a, it's a festival prelude. And a prelude is the beginning of something or something leading to some, a, a bigger event or something leading to a better event that's coming up. So, this piece is kind of a reminder. Let it be the prelude to your day. Just like breakfast is the most important meal of the day. If you don't eat breakfast in the morning, the rest of your day is down. If we don't do something to, in the beginning of the day, to, to speak to God, pray with God, get in communication with God, then the rest of our day is going to go downhill very quickly if we let it. So let today's song of the day be an exciting start to the new day. Forget about what happened on Monday. Forget about what happened on the weekend. Let today be an exciting new day. For this is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Let us pray. Father God, we thank you for allowing us to see another day. We thank you for touching our bodies and let us wake up to see another day. Let us be excited about this day. Let us honor you and praise you. For this is the day that you have made. You have created it, and Lord, let us rejoice and be glad in it, and let us celebrate you in this day. In Jesus' name, amen. I have one birthday to give a birthday shout out to. Happy birthday to Daniel Brown. I hope you're doing well. God bless you, and have a very blessed birthday on today. If you have any birthday shout outs, or any song requests, or just any comments in general, or if you would like to submit a performance to be used as the Song of the Day devotional, you may do so by leaving a message below this video in the message section, whether you're watching on YouTube, Facebook, or Twitter, or if I send it to you by text. Or you can send me a note on Facebook Messenger. I would love to hear from you, and I hope this song blesses you on today. God bless you. Thank you all so much for your support of this devotional ministry, and enjoy today's song of the day, a festival overture. Oh, not an overture. That's a Shostakovich. A festival prelude by Alfred Reed. And it's performed by the Otanawa Wind Symphonica from Japan. God bless. <laughs>